All right, everyone. So this video will show you how to properly use your new hydrogen and structured water bottle presented by Immortal. So the first thing you're gonna do is obviously you gotta charge it. So the uh, power cord has two tips. And the reason there are two tips is because there's two things to charge. You have the top part, which makes the water structured water. And you have the bottom part, which adds the hydrogen to the water, right? So you wanna plug these things in this little slot right here and you insert that in, and then you find the bottom one, which is over here. You insert that in, and then you plug it in and charge it. All right, and so it does not come charged. You will need to charge it before you use it, of course. Now, if you're in a rush, like I really wanna do this right now, you can actually put the water in while it's charging and it works. And so in this case, um, because this is already charged, I'm just gonna unplug it for demonstration purposes. So we can see. So once it's charged, you want to take um, filtered water. You don't want to fill this with tap water because that would not be good. Some of the contaminants in the water will react to the metal that's making the hydrogen. You know, produce unwanted chemicals basically. So you want to take the top lid off. It's not a screw; it's just a pressure. It's not a screw top. Put it down, and you fill it with filtered water as a reminder. And the height of the water ideally, essentially, is about a centimeter above the top of the Immortal logo right there, about a centimeter above it. And then you put the top of the bottle in and push down so it's sealed. And you notice there's about a centimeter of space between the top of this unit and the, the top edge of the water. You don't want this water to ever touch the top part, right? So you don't want it to be close because that can harm the unit. And then once you're done in this position, just put it down and there's a little button, that's like a typical on button. You hear that beep, you'll see the blue flashing light, you'll see the blue light light on, you'll see the gas bubbles start to being produced. And essentially right now it's using a electrical process as a reaction to generate the hydrogen and the top part is pulsing the sort of uh, electromagnetic energy at 7.83 Hertz to make the structured water Right, and so once this is done, it beeps and the lights go off and you want to drink it immediately, right, as soon as possible. The reason is if you let it sit, it stays, it stays structured water, which is fine, but the hydrogen is shooting out into space um, every second that you wait. So you do want to drink it immediately. Now, when it comes to cleaning, um, you, want to, you can clean the bottom with soap and water and it's fine. You obviously don't want to get water into where the plugs go in. So typically when I wash this, the bottom part, I put a finger, typically a thumb, over the hole where the plug's in just to make sure I don't get water in it. And you can put soap in here, you can scrub it all you want and wash it all you want. The top part, you cannot immerse in water. Right? So typically what I do is I get the sponge with the, with the soap and I wipe the top edge, just in case I wanna stop this to demonstrate. So I get like a sponge, I get soap around this and I rinse the the uh, top part with water running this way. So you don't want to rinse it like this. You don't want water to go into this space here. Right? So I hold it like this and rinse it from this angle, just kind of, you know, you pretend water's dripping down. I kind of turn this and get this soap off, right? And then when you're done, you just let it dry and you can use it again, right? And so and keep in mind that the charge will last uh, from having this for a while now, about 20 uses, right? So more than enough, right? You really only need to drink somewhere between two to five of these a day, right? So it'll last 20 uses. So you can charge probably for single use every three to four days. And this unit will last you, they estimate about eight to 10 years for per person. It'll last you a long time, right? So if there's any questions, reach out to me. I'd be more than happy to field those questions and put this to use. It's the technology is amazing. Again, if there's any questions on the science of this and the benefits, feel free to reach out.